Welcome back to the foundation. It's Anton with Quick Clove Marketing. And I just wanted to show you how to set your featured image for your uh, website or funnel um, and how to debug it. Now, when you set a featured image, for instance, this landing page, um, I'm actually using ClickFunnels here. Um, you go to SEO metadata and basically have your title you have your description this is what this is what shows up in the uh, search engines um and this is the image that shows up if you post it on social media um so you can type the link in and it'll automatically load up that uh, image with a quick little description of it so i'm thinking i want to change this image um as you can see in facebook i, I posted it and it is showing up um with the old image and I want to change it to a new image so I'm gonna show you how to do that now that the trick is to it and when you change it you have to debug it you have to go to the Facebook debugger and then you have to actually uh, reset it so let's see I'm gonna switch the image let's get a different one here I'm gonna do this one That might not be the right size, but we'll check it out. All right, let's add image. Yeah, so I want to run with that image right there instead. Um, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and save it in my funnel. So then you go to developers.facebook.com slash tools slash debug. And then you enter the URL. Let's go back to the URL. Um, I believe that one is all right. That is this is it right here. All right, and we'll go to click on debug. All right, so it has the old image on here. Um, now what I'm gonna do is hit scrape again. Still has it. And then now it comes up with the updated picture. Now, you see I didn't have the size right. So I don't like that. I want to change it again. So basically I can go back to click funnels. SEO metadata. We're gonna upload a different image. I like to do 1920 by 1080 or anything along those lines and in that in that actual shape. All right, let's add that image. All right, that should work a lot better. We're going to go to save. All right, and then let's scrape again. All right, and now it has it the way I want it to look. So if I go back to Facebook, uh, let's see here. Copy, and we'll go to post. When it fetches the preview, it's got the new uh, featured image. Um, and this goes for if I wanted to change the uh, title and the description, um, you basically want to go to the debugger, scrape it a couple times until it updates, and then it shows up the way you want it on uh, Facebook. Now, this works on uh, other types of w website builders, like uh, I've done it on WordPress. You have a section in WordPress, you have to go to the SEO settings, and, um, and then you can actually select the featured image and that will be your featured image it's the same deal you basically just go to the facebook debugger you plug in the the website whatever website it is click debug and scrape it and then you wait till it updates and you scrape it again and then it should update for you all right well i hope this is helpful and i'll see you in the next video